Let me give you a little testimony. When I fell in those days in school, I now said two, two hours every day. I will open Isaiah 53 and Psalm 91 because I was full of fears of dying. A doctor had told me that if I don't continue with my drugs, I may die. But I was too young. I said I was too young to be living on drugs. So I picked my Bible, Isaiah 53 and Psalm 91. Every day for two hours, I will go to the bush. All I'm doing is I'm talking. I can't be sick. I will open it and read it. I read it to a point that talk your way out of problem. Some of you, you are poor and many things that your business is not going fine. You are just leaving it and thinking that one day, one day, something where well, you are eating the consequences of your words. Something will happen. So, nothing is a lie. Nothing happens. You create your future. You are looking that you are already 35. Not, nobody is coming. You have not found scripture that you can be talking. Do you know I talked that scripture. By the time I got to the 25th day, that symptom vanished. And I said it was 40 days I would do. 20 something days it vanished. I continued the 40 days. After two weeks, the attack came back. But that time I was on my bed. The scripture of Psalm 91 wailed out. When I spoke it, boom, it was like a cloud. It left. There is an apostle of your confession. He is waiting and is watching. What are you saying? You know, I told you that the service is very is a, is a is a simple thing. You think, can we be honest now? Let's be honest. He told Joshua in Joshua chapter 1, verse 8, that this book of the Lord shall not depart from where. Let's be honest. How many of you truly spoke the word of God today for 30 minutes? Let's be honest. Are you saying that as simple as that is you can't keep it and you want victory? See, when God brought this to me, he said, come simple. This is the basics of Christianity that people are living, looking for big, big things to obey. They have not obeyed this. He says, this book of the law shall not depart from where? Ask your neighbor, to be honest, today did you take out time to speak God's word? Just, now, let him answer you. Let's be honest, let him answer you. Answer him genuinely, he will not arrest you. <laughs> My brother, what did he answer you? <laughs> you see? So it's no big mystery. When God say come back, tell these people to go back to this kindergarten. That's where victory is. Talk, talk. Look at, do you know what it means to rule the Israelites? These were millions of people and what God would tell Joshua. He didn't tell him, go and fast. He said, come, let me show you a secret how you win. Don't allow the book of the Lord to depart from your mouth. So, you know, Smith Wigglesworth was said, if his feet just touches the ground, he start talking. When he, you know some of you, if you wake up, Facebook, tolo, tolo, tolo. <laughs> he says, if his feet touches the ground, there is a man of God I know, every five minutes, he opens the Bible to read one verse. Whether he enter every five minutes. He said, he, he kept that every five minutes. When you go to E.W. Kenyon, they say, everywhere was an open Bible. He talks it. This man so worked in the miraculous that it was said during his time that he looks at broken bones that were shattered when he holds it they start coming together ask his daughter Ruth they gave himself to this simple thing that's why when you begin to read E.W. book, all he's telling you about is the substitutionary sacrifice of Jesus Christ if he teaches you on this word you will be shocked I am telling you that it's not big thing that will make your life it's this small thing if from today now you can truly just the way you don't miss there are many of you you can't even stretch for one day be my you are alive. Be you are. Sorry, my own life. Be my you are. You can't stay. And every day, people complain. They say they don't have time. They don't. And they eat every. They have time to for, for food. But now they can't. He said, man shall not live by what? Bread and but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. You are getting fat. Doing tests like this. Your spirit is feeding on snack. One snack per, per week. The one you come to Ecclesia to take. And that is just a snack. Imagine if you are eating a snack, meat pie. Kulu is even too much. You know, meat pie and bobo. <laughs> How can you survive? That is what you are feeding your spirit. And he tells you that in order to be victorious, something must not depart from your mouth. He now told him that for then you will make your way How? You are the one holding your prosperity. It's not a devil with you. That's why I said you are reaping the consequences of your watch. You are the one holding. You talk nonsense. All the one you watch from Netflix. Some of you, if you just read now, Netflix, Telemundo, 
no say then you will not come to the office and you start disturbing you hear with it oh boy see big brother you see that guy that big nonsense nonsense you are just chopping dead chopping dead and after you now say oh, i don't know what my life is doing like this you are reaping rubbish 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 is the consequences these things are basic go back to it keep a concentration every day for the whole of november and watch your life transit see when the lord started with me 5 a.m the day my father died i was it was 4 30. i was waiting for 5 a.m to stand up and start talking that's the first thing those days i do i will walk around my street like a madman for one hour sometimes i pull and i just talk see don't think there are certain things i don't want to see you see this of our good i have talked <laughs> Sometimes you don't do it in the daytime before they say, well, I, what that, what that, yeah. There was a day Holy Ghost came on me. And I I he said, start talking from your house. I talk down to treat. The moment I got to that traffic, he said, You will feel this place. He said, talk to it. Everything you are seeing today, we spoke it. This hope. I'm telling you the secret. The time when they rejected my admission. <laughs> One night after praying. God said, carry all your credentials, talk to them. Hope you know they hear. Jesus spoke to a fig tree. Did he hear him or not? And I started talking to my He said, You, you will be registered in the University of Agriculture Macaulay despite your deficiency. I will speak. He said, anoint all of them. You talk your way into success. Many of you, you are just waiting for some. Imagine if the whole of November now, from today or from tomorrow, set a time. There are certain things you have noticed in your life, in your business that you want to transit. Get scripture. All you do for 30 minutes, apart from prayer. He that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty God. Have you not made the earth round about him? Have you not made the earth round about my family members? You mentioned their name. Have you not made an earth round about all that I have on every side? Therefore, my business, you are just talking like a madman. When they wake up and they say, Mommy, what is happening to you? Don't worry, sleep. Some of you should be, they should look. <laughs> Let me not go into some things. If your roommate and people you are staying with doesn't look you as a madman, something is wrong. Because in this kingdom, how we win is that we talk. And God said, Let there be what? God saw darkness. God now what? 